Hey you guys, so in today's video we're going to be going out to the storage unit to check on the 370Z and the motorcycle. They've both been in storage for a little over a month now, so I'm going to take you guys along with me, and I will see you guys when we get there. Hey you guys, so we just got to the storage unit now. Let's open it up. See if I can do this one handed here. Looking good. Looking good. So last time uh, that we were here, I was just putting the Nissan away. And it didn't go too well. I mean, it went okay, but it got dark and then it was really hard to see. So I kind of had to back the Mustang up and have it facing right in here so we could see. But yeah, I remember huh, last time it got dark way too early. So luckily I had the Mustang here. I just pulled it up here and faced it right in the storage unit so I had some light. Um, car cover looks really nice, fits perfectly. It's from Z1 Motorsports. Got a little pocket for the mirrors. Yeah, really not bad. I could probably pull this down more a little bit. Yeah, it's definitely a snug fit. Then we have the motorcycle. This cover is really nice as well. We got the OEM 370Z seats over here. I just covered these up with uh, sheets so they don't get all full of crap. So both of these covers, the one on the motorcycle and the one on the 370, um, they are basically made to fit these vehicles. They aren't like a universal cover. Um, they are specifically made for each vehicle. So this is made for the bike, that's made for the Nissan. I highly recommend you get one that's not universal because usually they don't fit too well and you're gonna struggle putting it on, you know. Um, and I know, for example, like for my motorcycle cover, my dad has a universal one while it's gigantic, but it's really cheap. Um, this material is really nice, really thick. 
Um, the one I got him was just at Walmart for like 20 bucks. It works, it's just not as um, protective. Doesn't fit as nice. So, another thing I wanna talk about in today's video is next year I will probably be upgrading to a 10 by 26 storage unit if I can. Um, right now we're in a 10 by 20. Really not much room. We got about uh, maybe a foot and a half here. Plenty of room on the sides. But then up front here we have again about a foot and a half. This is the edge of the storage unit right here. So really not much room. The sides is okay. I mean, what I have to do is I have to really park it to the right of the storage unit so I can actually get out of the car. But uh, not bad, just a little bit cramped. I mean, I can barely squeeze through the 370 in the bike. There's really not much room. Just enough for me to get through. Got the seats here. Now, if you look on the passenger side, there's really no room on the passenger side over there. But again, I have to park it way over here so I can actually get out of the car without hitting anything. Then there's this uh, storage shelf up there. I don't have anything up there right now, mainly because I'm afraid that that thing will collapse and fall on the bike or the Nissan or both. Um, I don't really trust it that much to be honest. It looks stable, it looks really stable, but I just don't want to risk it right now. So yeah, I think next year I'm going to upgrade to a 10 by 26. I mean, that's an extra six feet of room, so that'll be nice. Um, I do have some, the actually the 20s that were on the Impala a couple years ago, um, I have those in my house, so I'll probably put the 20 inch wheels in here, the seats will be in here, the bike will be in here, the car will be in here. Might be able to put some other car parts in here. So having that additional six feet will really help. But, so this is just a good um, kind of like, I don't know, I wouldn't say size comparison video, but this is a 10 by 20. Um, I've posted a video about it a couple times. So really, I mean, I can fit my motorcycle and my 370Z and my seats, and that's really about it. Um, not too bad. If you got a truck or something like that, might not fit too well. But it works pretty good for me. So, well, I think that's going to wrap up today's video. I kind of just wanted to show you guys what the storage unit looks like. I wanted to show you guys the cover in the day uh, because last time, obviously, you couldn't really see it because it was dark out. So I just wanted to show you what this all looks like and let you guys know that I'll be upgrading to a 10 by 26 next summer, hopefully. There's the Mustang sitting nice and pretty. Let's get wrap up this video. Thanks for watching, and I will leave a link in the description down below to the video of me putting the Nissan away and putting the bike away. And in those videos, I have the link to the car cover in the Nissan video, and I believe I have the link to the uh, motorcycle cover in that video. But yeah, so I will leave a link in the description down below to putting the 370Z away and putting the bike away if you want to check those out. Thanks for watching.